Hi, Lynn Maggio here with Norman Halim in Malaysia at the market here at the 65th Annual Cannes Film Festival. Excited to be here. And right now we're going to talk a little bit about the movie uh, that I saw the trailer on yesterday, Vikingdom. Vikingdom, Viking. yes. Yeah, so tell me a little bit about the name, first of all. Where'd you get the idea for the name? Well, it's uh, because the story is about Viking mythology intertwined with Viking history. We wanted to create a franchise, a name, a brand that can stick in people's mind. And, and um, it started off as just Viking and Kingdom, but so we decided to combine the two together so that we can even patent the name as, as Vikingdom because we intend to create a franchise out of this brand name. Watching the trailer yesterday was so exciting. I wanted to see the movie right then and oh, there. Thank you. So it was very well done. But uh, there's so many great things Malaysia has to offer yes. as, as far as uh, film. Uh, it was interesting the snow. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> because it yeah. doesn't snow in Malaysia, right? It doesn't snow in Malaysia. But, you know, I think, you know, in this, uh, in this the digital age of producing uh, content, film, and, you know, you can shoot anywhere in the world and establish, uh, you know, any kind of backgrounds. And uh, what we like to position or what we like to do, why we pick Vikingdom as our first international uh, Hollywood cast uh, project is because that we want to demonstrate what we can do in Malaysia. And if we can do a Viking movie in Malaysia in a tropical climate, we can do any kind of movies uh, that, that, you know, that comes along. So I, I would say that, that it's, it's, uh, it's, it was challenging because it was our first uh, uh, project that involves you know, quite a number of casts and from Hollywood. And also uh, we had like almost hundreds of people every day. And I think it was uh, the biggest scale production ever we've actually handled. That, that is very exciting, and y'all had a great turnout yesterday, obviously, but tell me a little bit about the plot. Tell us mm -hmm. a little bit about the storyline. Well, the story revolves around Eric. Uh, he's, the, um, he's the king of uh, a particular tribe in, in, the, Viking er uh, in the Viking village, uh, and, um, and he is an undead. He, actually, he was killed in a, in a particular war. In the beginning, it's, it's a story about a guy who actually died in the very beginning. So, uh, but he got uh, a second chance, and his uh, uh, immortal lover Freya uh, gave him his life again. And 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 years down the road, he he's, he he lives a, a regretful life. He, he doesn't want to be to be continue to to be alive. Uh, and and because of that, you know, he actually lives in a remote area. But you know, there was a call, and especially Freya's uh, Freya's brother Frey, uh, and uh, start, start uh, and convince him that he needs to actually do something about about a coming war and it's a story about basically like I said it's a it, you have all these characters like you know Freya, Freya Thor um, uh, in, 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 a, in, a, in a mythological kind of uh, way but we also have you know uh, Eric you know having having Thor attacking Lindisfarne which is actually the, the accurate uh, history in, in the Viking era uh, 793 AD where, where they first attacked Lindisfarne a church in Lindisfarne so you know we actually link it all together and, uh, and Eric has to find um, the, the Horn of Hell, which is actually hidden in Helheim, which is hell. And only an undead can enter into Helheim and get the, uh, the Horn to actually defeat Thor. Wow. Yeah. That is so neat. Well, it, 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 was, is, it was so exciting. So it's obviously full of action. And yes. it looks like one of those movies that when you sit down... It's, it's packed with action the entire movie. Action so. and adventure. Because you, it moves from one place to the other. Imagine someone who actually, you know, would actually uh, mix around with all the mortals and all these things that are happening you know, on the, in the Midgard, what we call as Earth, Midgard. And he goes down in Helheim, which is actually hell. And, and, uh, and he will fight demons and zombies and stuff like that. So all in one movie is very so exciting. Nice. Yeah. Cool. And you've already got requests for a second one? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I just spoke to our sales, comp sales agent and, and he said that you know, there's a request of uh, doing a sequel to Vikingdom. I said, hey, we've not even completed one. But he said this is the right time to, to actually consider about you know, doing a sequel. That's exciting. Yeah. That's exciting. Well, we wish you the best of luck. Thank you so much for taking out you know, time of your, your, your busy schedule to talk to us. And can't wait to see the movie so thank we're you, awesome Lynn. the trailer was phenomenal i know the movie will be even better thank you Lynn. thank you thank so you much. much lynn maggio right here at the malaysia film at the malaysia uh, area in the market at the Cannes 65th annual film festival